wherever you are around the world, lift up your hands and bless his name. Bless his name. Thank him for a new day. We are officially in a new day. Thank him for his loving kindness that wakes us up. Thank him for his faithfulness that sees us through each and every day. Thank him. 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 Say, Father, we thank you for day one. Thank you for day two. Thank you for day three. Thank you for day four. Thank you for day five. Thank you for day six. Thank you for day seven. Thank you for day eight. Thank you for day nine. Thank you for day ten. Thank you for day eleven. Thank you for day twelve. Open your mouth and thank you. Twelve is the number of government, the number of dominion. And tonight, the Lord will exercise dominion over sicknesses, over infirmities, over all the powers of the enemy. Thank you. Thank you. Bless the Lord, oh my soul, and all that is within me. Bless his holy name. For the Lord is good and his mercy endures forever. My God, my God. That's right. Thank you. Oh, your God, of God. Thank you, thank you tonight. Just before, just before we get into singing, the Bible says, come into his presence with singing. Psalm 100. I don't want to be tempted to sing because when I start, I won't want to interrupt it. So we share one or two scriptures to set the context for tonight. And then I want to say, if you know everyone sick tonight and you think they are not online, I want you to be a messenger of the gospel and of good news. Call them up. Tag them. Because I see a healing rain falling down. There will be healings all across the world. Alright. I have received numerous testimonies of backache healed. I'm, I'm seeing that recurrent frequently in my personal ministry. I've seen the hallelujah challenge and that's why I proclaim it. I have seen severe backache. As a matter of fact, I visited a doctor in the United States of America on my last visit. A, one of the top doctors in Texas, I won't mention the, 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 the county or the particular city, not Houston, not Dallas. And this, this person who owns a, a a big hospital. I went there. I went to pray there. You know, you know, and a couple of I I know a couple of them around the U.S. Our friends, and I got a testimony. A doctor. I hope he was because he didn't say someone sent it to him. From he said he'd been sick and having this backache for ten years. This is a an expert doctor, and one of those nights the word came, and he was healed. So tonight, as we pray and worship and, you know, sing, the man of God will come. My friend is here. My friend and brother, he touched him. At the right time, I'll introduce him. We do ministry together from time to time, from Liberia to Bradford to Abuja, just dispensing the healing grace of God. Amen. And I partner with him. So I, I called him to come here and release that 
grace that I've seen in his life. Amen. So call anyone. Tell them to join now. Send them the link. Share it. God, the, Dr. Jesus is online. Say, Dr. Jesus is online. <laughs> Say, Dr. Jesus is online. Let's go to John 12. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. John 12. John 12. Let's read one to go. Then Jesus, six days before the Passover, came to Bethany, where Lazarus was, which had been dead, whom he raised from the dead. Then they made him a supper, and Martha served. But Lazarus was one of them that sat at the table with him. Then took Mary a pound of ointment of spikenard, very costly, and anointed the feet of Jesus and wiped his feet with her head. And the house was filled with the odor of the ointment. This morning, you're going to release your, anoint, your ointment in praise and worship. For the next 20 minutes or so or less, I don't want you to ask him for anything. We sang this song we're going to sing right now in church and it opened up a portal in church. We will stay on the song for a while and then we'll bring up the man of God. Amen. At midnight, Paul and Silas prayed and sang praises unto God. And the prisoners heard them. Suddenly, suddenly there was a great earthquake so that the foundations of the prisons were shaken and immediately all the doors were open and everyone's bands were loose. Lift up your hands. There is none. There is not beside thee.
proclaiming his person. You are proclaiming who he is. Yeshua Hamashiach, the one who arises with healing in his wings. Jesus is the Lord, Jesus. Jesus. Hey. Jesus. His name is as ointment poured for. Come on. That's right. One more time. Jesus is the Your 
of sickness say every knee must bow every tongue come on first hey, understand that you are commanding it's a decree I say every knee must bow every tongue Issuing a decree tonight, say every knee must bow, every tongue confess that Jesus the Lord. say every knee must bow, every tongue. him open your mouth and just bless his name your name is exalted in the heavens exalted in the earth hallelujah 
sing with me your name sing. your name is exalted in the heavens exalted in the earth hallelujah Him say, oh Lord, oh Lord, say, oh Lord, your kingdom, your kingdom reigns forever. Your kingdom has no end. Your kingdom has no end. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Your name is exalted. Lift your hands to him. Say your name. Your name is exalted. He's exalted. Exalted. Oh. As the trumpet has played. I want you to lift your hands and worship him. you are just lift up your voice and call that name Jesus Jesus call it as many times as you can with faith Jesus thou son of David have mercy on me I hear that scripture tonight Jesus thou son of David I hear that scripture thou son of David thou son of David Jesus thou son of David Yeshua Hamashiach Hallelujah. I want you to get ready. The rain is already falling. The atmosphere is set. The healer is here. No one else is the healer. There is only one healer. And he lives in us. He will dispense healings. Diverse healings. Through his servant tonight. I have my, my friend and brother we have known for years serving Jesus together met at the city of David knew him as a military officer rose by the grace of God to be a major general and not only did he retire as a major general but he's a general is a general in the Lord's army. Let's switch now. And I've seen this healing grace on his life grow. And I said to him, please come. And I asked him to come with his psalmist, if a faithful, faithful man who has served in the church, Minister Friday, and they will be leading and will support them. 
tonight and just release your faith. Oh, thank you, Jesus. I was praying and I heard the word faith. You know, release your faith. Tell someone, release your faith. Believe that God can do just about anything. So with a good God bless you. Welcome my friend and brother, Pastor General Pat Akembingi. And he will bring up his mister. Amen. Bless you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, my brother Nathaniel Basi and Sarah and every other person that has been collaborating with this wonderful servant of the living God that is my friend and brother. Okay, uh, before Friday ministers and then I come back to to begin to pray for the sick, I want to just quickly signpost some things very quickly. First, uh, God uses me to God uses me to heal in multiple ways. For instance, for instance, I go around shaking hands with new guests in church, and then I shake hands with somebody who is not a new guest, who is a member of the church, and then they get healed, Amen. just like that. Or I touch somebody on the head, and they get healed. Um, he uses me when I anoint people with oil and lay hands on them. Or when I lay hands ordinarily without anointing. But they, he uses me also what I call wholesale healing. Hallelujah. Everybody say wholesale healing. Wholesale healing. Yeah, when, the, when it's a crusade, you can't lay hands on people, everybody. Okay, so when it's a crusade, you can't lay hands on everybody. So you make declarations. And for this meeting, the Lord says any declaration we make is in those. So, everything I say, for instance, while we're worshiping, I receive that he'll be raining down new wombs for ladies that need them. For ladies that need new wombs, he'll be raining them down. Okay, so I'll be doing declarations. I'll be doing what we call wholesale healing by the hand of the living God. And through that matchless name, the name above all names, Jesus Christ, the Son of the living God, that is alive forevermore. Amen. So, Nathan, uh, I mean, uh, Friday will come quickly, and then we'll do some worship, and I'll come back to lay a quick foundation and then make some declarations. And people will hear all over the world Amen. in Jesus' glorious name. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Jesus, we love you. We praise you and adore you. Glorify your name in all the earth. Glorify your name tonight, Lord. Glorify your name. Glorify your name. Glorify your name in all the earth. Can we sing it again? Glorify your name.
the trumpet, can we shout? And the good news is that he does not refer his cases. <laughs> Thank you, our Jesus. And he is the same yesterday, today, and forever. So in Luke chapter 4, verse 18 down to 19, Luke 4, 4, uh, 4 18 to 19, the Bible says, The Spirit of the Lord is upon me, because he has anointed me to preach the gospel to the poor. He has sent me to heal the brokenhearted, to proclaim liberty to the captives and recovery of sight to the blind, to set at liberty those who are oppressed, to proclaim the acceptable year of the Lord. The good news also is that this was his manifest done and it is still his manifest today. The only difference is that he is accused it through us, his disciples. And so we are here to discharge people from hospitals in the name of the Lord to go home. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah, we, we, we practice it. We, we, in Abuja, we went to a big hospital and we actually we pray for them and telling you are discharged to go home. And two days later, three quarters of them have gone home. This thing works. Yes. Jesus, the same yesterday, today, and forever. One another thing you need to know about healing is that you were healed before you became sick. You were healed before you became sick. Let me prove, prove it to you from the word of God. First Peter chapter 2, verse 24. 1 Peter 2, 24. Who himself bore our sins in his own body on the tree, that we having died to sins might live for righteousness, by whose stripes you were healed. You were what? Healed. Not I will be healed. If we keep putting it tomorrow or later, the devil will eat your breakfast, lunch, and dinner. You were healed before you became sick, and sickness is illegal because he took it away. Now, it can be body, soul, spirit. For instance, in church yesterday, we had a destiny recovery service two Sundays ago. In church yesterday, a sister, when we were doing the service, I was moving around and touching people and praying over them. So I told this sister, and she said because when she couldn't get married on time, her brother took her to a witch doctor to do something to fast track the process. In the process of that, she opened the doorway for the devils to come in. So she was carrying an individual person and a, a spirit being inside her. As I laid hands on her and prayed in the spirit, 
they, this man dressed in, in, in red and blue garment, caught in pieces like that, walked out of her and said, this man has come again. It was me they were referring to as this man has come again. I said, yes, Jesus we know. <laughs> Paul we know. Pastor Pat we also know. <laughs> the, devils, the devils know us. Okay? So he heals body, soul, spirit. I'll be making declaration shortly. He heals body, soul, spirit. One more scripture to show you that he heals body, soul, spirit. He said in Jeremiah chapter 30 verse 17. Jeremiah 30 17. He said, for I will restore hate unto thee. And I will heal thee of thy wounds, says the Lord. Because they call their outcast, saying, This is Zion, whom no man seeketh after. This was a condition that made people to despise the individual. To despise a whole nation. So it, it wasn't just that they were, they were sick. Emotional wounds were healed. When God sees a complete package. And tonight is a complete package. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Beloved, I wish above all things that don't make us prosper. And be hurt. Even as that so prospered. So pray in tongues for two minutes. Then I start making declarations. Jika talabrana kina gabaskara sota. Gali bala lege gargasala sota shandina. Gargadala laga gargadela sandina masherida. Gargadia lado, gargadia lado, gargadia lado, gargadia lado koriba. Gari bandele gekira raga bandele gekira raga saraboskaya. Gali bala lege saraboska pasara jende. Kari balalege sarajenda lakina gabrama sakatana loda. In the name of Jesus the Christ. Amen. Father, in the name of Jesus. We declare, Heavenly Father, comprehensive healing and restoration. In the name of Jesus. Father, I rebuke every spirit of infirmities upon your people. The spirits of infirmities are rebuked now in the name of Jesus. Father, your word says every plant which our Heavenly Father has not planted shall be rooted out. I command every planting of the enemy in your life. Be rooted out in the name of Jesus. Wherever you are in the world, put your hand on your head. Your right hand on your head. My Father and my God, I declare Heavenly Father, oh God. Healing Heavenly Father of backs. Heavenly Father, back pains are healed now. In the name of Jesus. Waste pain healed now. In the name of Jesus, chest pain healed now. In the name of Jesus, Father, I come against blood related sicknesses and diseases. In the name of Jesus, I command your blood to be cleansed, purified by the blood of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, my Father, I come against heart diseases, Heavenly Father. I command, Heavenly Father, congestive heart disease. You are discharged to go home from hospital. In the name of Jesus, I come against menstrual, painful menstrual cycles. I command them to cease now. Cease now. Cease now. In the name of Jesus, irregular menstrual cycles, you are restored to no mercy. In the name of Jesus, you have stopped menstruating. I command you, I command it, it is restored now. In the name of Jesus, my Father, my God, I come against high blood pressure in the name of Jesus. Low blood pressure in the name of Jesus. I come against diabetes. In the name of Jesus. Diabetes you are dismissed. In the name of Jesus. Kidney failure you are restored to health. No more dialysis. No more dialysis. No more dialysis. In the name of Jesus. Father that operation that surgery is cancelled. I cancel surgeries all over the world. All over the world. They are no longer needed. In the name of Jesus the Christ, my father, I come against arthritis. Be made whole in the name of Jesus. Be made whole in the name of Jesus. I command fallopian tubes to open up. Open up. Open up. In the name of Jesus. I command wombs to open up and receive seed. In the name of Jesus. I come against low sperm count. Come back to no mercy. In the name of Jesus. I reverse monopoles. Premature monopoles. You are reversed. You are reversed. You are reversed. In the name of Jesus, I rebuke ulcers and command them to live now. Ulcer go. Ulcer go. Ulcer go. In the name of Jesus, I command blind eyes to open now. In the name of Jesus, blind eyes open in the name of Jesus. Deaf and dumb spirit go in the name of Jesus. 
Let your ears open up now in the name of Jesus. Rika Shadabala Kaskede Masanda. Oh, Father, I rebuke every form of cancer. I rebuke pancreatic cancer in the name of Jesus. Cancer of the pelvic. You go in the name of Jesus. Oh, Rima Kasakatora, enlarge prostrate. Come back to no man. No mercy. Enlarge prostrate. Come back to no mercy. In the name of Jesus. I rebuke reflux. In the name of Jesus. Heart bone. In the name of Jesus. I command swelling to go. Inflammations go. Inflammations go. Inflammations go. I rebuke migraines in the name of Jesus. Father, again, I rebuke cancers. Cancerous cells that are waiting to manifest many years down the line. I command you to dry up. And you will never manifest. You will never manifest. You will not manifest in the name of Jesus. Rika Kadalabrana. Students all over the world receive supernatural brain power. You will understand difficult concepts easily. From now on, you are intensely intelligent. Intensely intelligent. No more carryovers. No more repeating, repeating classes and courses. In the name of Jesus. Father, I command stagnancy to end. Stagnancy, you are terminated. Ungodly suffering, you end now. In the name of Jesus. Fruitless efforts come to an end now. In the name of Jesus. That withered heart comes back to life. That withered heart comes back to life. In the name of Jesus. Father, I cancel premature death. I cancel premature death. I reverse the reports of doctors concerning terminal sicknesses and diseases. Their reports are reversed. Reverse. 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 Father, I order a comprehensive, complete turnaround. Comprehensive turnaround. Comprehensive turnaround. Comprehensive turnaround. Comprehensive turnaround. Comprehensive turnaround. Comprehensive all round turnaround. Financial turnaround. Turn around in careers. Turn around in businesses. Turn around in marriages. Comprehensive turn around. In the name of Jesus. No more marital delay. No more marital delay. Prima Kasakira Gabala Sato Sekia. Kashende Kia Gabala Soto. Father, in the name of Jesus, I, I declare, as in those by heaven, that no one under the sound of my voice labels under the weight of any sickness and disease. Amen. Again, beginning now, Amen. in the name of Jesus, I command evil laws to go. Amen. Evil laws go. Amen. Evil laws go. Burdens are lifted. Burdens are lifted. Burdens are lifted. In the name of Jesus. Those sores in the mouth. Somebody has sores in the mouth. They dry up now. They dry up now. That wound that has refused to heal. Receive marching orders to heal now. 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 Now in the name of Jesus. STDs. Go. HIV. Go. HIV. Go. HIV. Go. HIV. Go. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, our Father. Rima Kasata Bashata Kasa. Karga de Liga Koto Saka Rabos Kandea. Kariba Lalede Shakira Gabara Satu. In Jesus' wonderful name we have prayed. Amen. Thank you, our Jesus. Thank you, our Jesus. Thank you, our Jesus. One more time, Pastor. But I'm going to please, let's, I. There are certain words that came to me and I want to declare together with you. First, we're going to declare, please give Pastor Pat a, a, a mic, that we cancel cancer. Say, we yes. cancel cancer. Yes. Father, in the name of Jesus. In the lives of God's people. Yes. Say, in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In every life. In every life. In anybody. In anybody. We cancel cancer. 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 Cancer die. Cancer die in the name of Jesus. Cancer, you are rooted out completely. Disappear. You die from the roots. Disappear. Disappear now. Disappear. You are dismissed. Disappear. Dismissed. 
disappear. This means disappear. disappear in the name of Jesus. Let the lumps Rika disappear. Check them now. Check oh, them now. They are Shekina, gone. Gabolo, they are gone. We cancel. Go, cancer. go, 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 go. Cancer, we cancel go. Cancer. Go. We cancel cancer. cancer, go. We cancer, cancer, go. You are canceled. Anywhere he went. Yes. You are canceled. He was to win. A mighty healer. He healed the land. Well. Celebrate the man of God. Hey! 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 Everything's gonna be alright.
family with a crippled child, that child is commanded to rise up and walk. In the name of Jesus. And we use that child as a point of contact for every cripple. Jesus says, rise up and walk in Jesus' wonderful name. Amen. Lift your hands and thank Jesus. Stretch forth your hands and bless the man of God and his service. I see testimonies break out. Begin to send them online. Begin to send them. Begin to send them. Go to the website. In Jesus' mighty name, you live here upgraded. The healing grace is upgraded. In Jesus' mighty name. Put your hands together for Jesus. A couple of things before we go. But let me say this. I saw, when I was standing there, I saw someone with a strange finger condition. I received that one clearly. Very rare, strange condition with your fingers. I declare them healed right now. There's somebody else. The words the doctors used when they were diagnosing your condition was they use the word no remedy. I saw the word remedy. Dr. Jesus says there is a remedy. And you just received a remedy tonight. Another person, the lame is walking already. There's somebody, your affliction started when you ate a piece of cake. Something happened, I don't know if it was poison or if it was food poisoning. But after you ate that cake, something changed in your health whatever you ate whatever poison you ate is reserved is reversed right now is reversed right now in the name of jesus in the name of jesus swellings have disappeared in jesus mighty name can you put your hands together for the lord keep clapping keep clapping Now, as it is our custom, everyone who comes to dispense grace unto us. Now, everyone I minister with, trust me, before I get anyone to minister either in church or hallelujah challenge, I make sure that they are from a very pure source. As a matter of principle, I don't collaborate with people who don't love Jesus. I don't collaborate with hirelings. I don't collaborate with people who deploy underhanded means in the preaching of the gospel. I collaborate with like-minded ministers. And this one is one of them. And when people come to minister to us as a hallelujah challenge, we give them an offering. We write them a good check. They, they don't charge us a dime. It is scriptural. First Timothy 5.17. Quickly. New Living Translation. I'm giving you a basis because I know there are people out there who criticize me and all. But, but like I told you, I've developed a thick skin for that and a tender heart. Once it's in the Bible, I'm okay. Elders who do their work well should be respected and do what? And what? Especially those who work hard at both preaching and teaching. Does this man look like somebody who has spent time with the word? I'm a stickler for the word. If it's in the Bible, it's okay. So what we're going to do, after tonight, we're going to have a page on the website, his picture and bank details. I give you permission to go and harass him with blessings. Tell him thank you so Paul says, I do not desire a gift. I've learned to abound at this. But I desire fruit that will abound to your account. So we're going to sow into this, this, this man of God and we'll bless his ministry as well. Amen. Amen. Please, can you help us with um, altar call? Take altar call very quickly in about two minutes. Face the camera and just...
Karagadede Sakira. I want to quickly tell us that the Lord Jesus is more interested in somebody's soul than in their health, even though the health is important. You see, because he said, precious in the eyes of the Lord is the date of his sent. When the sent comes home, Jesus stands up to welcome them. So you need to be his sent. And sainthood is not something they just ascribe. It's something the Lord confesses by you being born again. The Bible says you must be born again. It is not church. It has nothing to do with church, even though church is important. It's whether your name is in the book of life. Once somebody's eyes are closed in death, they quickly check whether the name is in the book of life. If it is not, they go to wait in a place called hell for the white throne judgment where the hell and Israel will be going to the lake of fire. God doesn't want anybody to do that because he did an investment that is too heavy. He invested with his son. So he pays him to lose his soul. He doesn't want the devil to rejoice over your soul that he has captured you. So quickly, 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 simple. It is belief in the heart. It is confession with the mouth. So say, Lord Jesus, Lord Jesus I believe that you are the son of God. You are the God that became flesh for my own sake. You went to the cross. You died for my sins. You were buried. You conquered death. You rose again on the third day. And you are alive forevermore. I commit my life to you. Body, soul, spirit. I declare and confess that which I believe. That you are the Lord of my life. The Lord of my body, soul, spirit. I confess that Jesus Christ is my Lord. On account of which I ask that you will write my name in the book of life. Forgive all my sins. Put them under the covering of your blood. Jesus Christ is Lord. In Jesus' name. Precious Father, we commit them into your hands. Keep them by your power. Keep them till the end. When it is all over and you are counting your jewels, let these ones that are making this commitment tonight be numbered among the saints. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Thank you, our Jesus. For in Jesus' wonderful name we have prayed. Amen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Please put up the details there. You'll see uh, a link and a barcode. A link and a barcode. See, when, when somebody is doing the altar call, you already have that thing set. It's not when they finish you are looking. I'm seeing you looking at this. I'll say it. Let the whole world hear. Guys, be proactive. So you look at the link, click the link, or scan the barcode, all right, and then you fill the form. And when you fill the form, we'll get in contact with you. It is so important and vital that you do this because we need to help you. We need to send you a Bible free of charge. It's part of the things we use the money here for. We send you a pamphlet. We have a team, you know, on ground to help you, you know, with a few classes. And then we recommend Bible-believing churches around for you to go to and be established. Amen. All right. And then put up the link for um, giving. I mean, those who want to partner with us, you love the work that we do. And hope you know that Hallelujah Challenge has got full-time staff. So we don't just have people who work on volunteer basis. We have people who work permanently, full-time basis. They earn good salaries. We take care of them. We send them on trips and all. So it's part of what we do. We engage in good corporate social responsibilities. And for example, this week we said we want to feed about 10,000 people on one of the nights to raise a sacrifice. And then after the Hallelujah Challenge, we always give education, scholarship, educational scholarship. This year, we want to make it 10 million naira. You know, give about 100,000 to 100 people just to help. You know, times are tough in our nation. I mean, if God blesses us, we'll take it to 20 million. And we give, you've, heard, you've seen in the past, so we use money for that. And then also, bless these young man, men and women. What we do after the challenge, we give them good offerings. I believe I'm a balanced person. You see, I don't, God told me years ago, don't charge a dime when you go to minister. I am a sign and wonder of God's faithfulness. I'm on God's payroll. Amen. And even on this challenge, I made a personal decision not to take a penny out of the account. Of course, people are free to reach out. 
you know, when as God leads them to bless us, but it's my personal consecration so that when I feel like I'm doing hallelujah challenge again and it's not that money inspiring me. Amen. Amen. So these are the sacrifices that we live. So when we say give, we're not saying because we want to have the money. God raised some of us in the desert, in the wilderness. Amen. And you know, he, we're representing him well. So give as the Lord, you know, leads you. Amen. And then about the tickets, don't log off. Today, Monday, in Lagos, Lekki and VI, Lekki and VI Center will put out, will put up an address. By 12 lunch hour, you can go there and get your access card. Now, the reason why we're doing that is because we realize that if we keep releasing all the tickets online, which we, we will still do, we are selling people because it's a global thing. We have about, how many people do, do we have on YouTube today? We had about, what? Talk to me. 100, over 103,000 people on YouTube alone. You know, Instagram, 34, 33,000. So, and a lot of these people don't live in Nigeria. And they won't have plans to come. So, imagine we put out 2,000 tickets and they take it and they don't show up. So, that's why we're making sure that people who take the tickets are those who come. Now, there are people abroad. We have said, if you are abroad and you have your tickets to come in, once you come in, you have guaranteed space. We have hundreds of tickets for you. So, we want to make sure that those in Lagos and environs have the tickets. So, we have that we will announce the centers in Lekki and VI. You go there and pick up a pass, all right? And then we'll release another 1,000 tomorrow night, day 13. Sorry, tonight. Tonight, day 13, another 1,000. I beg you. And I, I take God, beg you. I beg. <laughs> if you won't come for the challenge, don't take the ticket. Eh? Please. So that you don't stop other people. Only take the tickets if you want to come. They are free of charge. You don't need to pay. But please allow those who need to come. And if you take the ticket and don't intend to come anymore, be kind to reach out to us and so that we would, you know, transfer the tickets. May the Lord bless you. Amen. Amen. Jesus CA will be out on November 5th. I listened to the recording. It's, it is too anointed. Tobechuku is child's play. <laughs> Ebeniza is, is, is kindergarten what I heard. So take your journals. And then Yahweh Sabot. Hey, the, the anointing is heavy. Every time I listen to the recording and what they are doing, I'm praying in the spirit. Christmas will never be the same. We are releasing some, 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 some rods to the kingdom of God to flog the devil and, and part races and glorify. Are you ready? Give me my journal. Day 13, we are going to attack some court cases, stubborn court cases. You know, declare that we'll bring an end to them. So let's dance over our journals. Are you ready? Yes, sir. Jesus here. You have done it again. Jesus here. As you dance, you are taking dominion. Father, we dance and decree a turn around. Song very soon, both of you. Quick, quick, quick. Hold your wife. Jesus, quick. You have done it. That's my boy. Yeah.
news that will make you put your hand on your head. Jesus! You have done it again. Jesus! By the way, have you been blessed by Wana? Wana is my prodigy. You know, I've seen him grow. Amazing trumpet player. He's doing, he has great songs. What's your YouTube page again? Let me. Wana took. Please go and subscribe. Say it loud. Uh, you know, uh, you are, no, Wana to the world. Say it. Wana took. Wana took. Wana took. So go there, subscribe, follow him. Great young man. You know, followed me for years and is doing great things. Hallelujah. So let's blow. His baby is coming. His baby is coming in glory. <laughs> Every eye will see. We thank iFix. iFix is the internet. You know those days we used to have internet problem. <laughs> people would, would talk, people would say to me, Pastor Nat, what, which, are you using dial-up? <laughs> they would say, can we come and help you? Today we have gone internet. <laughs> Thanks to iFix. Show Gear, Simon Coopers, Carol Film, Premium Trust Bank, Zenith Bank, Evently. And then have you seen the billboards over Lagos? They said I shouldn't mention them. I will mention them. <laughs> Ezine and Stanley, thank you. God bless you. Blessing overload, go follow you. Blessing, go follow you. In Jesus' name. Amen. God bless you. See you day 13. Day 13, we're going to deal with very serious court cases. Amen. And other things, other obstacles in life. Amen. Amen.